Vanessa German is an international award-winning artist who moved to Homewood five years ago. Well, I grew up performing in LA in a time where South Central Los Angeles was crazy, when you know, it was like a war zone and people were getting killed, kids were getting killed, drive-by shootings, walk-by shootings. When I was um, in the seventh grade, when I was in the sixth grade, I had to decide that if I was gonna walk and be around living and breathing, that I needed to make sure that I was doing things that, um, that I was living in, that I was doing things that I wouldn't regret, that I was doing things that brought me joy because I could get taken out. I went to um, a couple of schools that focused on art. And I got to a place when I was probably 18 where I wanted to um, tell my own stories. And so I started to write my own stories because I felt like I had something that I wanted to say that nobody was saying. And I needed to have a place where I could live and work and also be inspired to work. Pittsburgh is a good place for artists, but I feel like something's happening in Homewood, that Homewood has both um, a really exciting and dynamic history, you know, from whether it's history of jazz, like Westinghouse, Billy Strayhorn, and music. Uh, what changes have I seen in the Homewood community? Wow. That's an interesting question. I've seen a lot of trees have been cut down at Homewood because there's a blight on some of these trees. They have a disease and they're being hollowed out from the inside out. So I had to get the tree in my front yard cut down. When I cut down that tree, people from the neighborhood would, kept stopping by and wanting to get pieces of it because they had seen that tree there for years and years and years. And the lady came out, she said, that tree been there since I came in 1959. It's as though doors and windows and stories and people keep opening up around me. And uh, Homewood is a really impressive place. I was in the first class of fellows at August Wilson Center. They have a program um, where you can apply to be an artist that they support for a year to create a new work. And I created a spoken word opera called Root. And I'm in the August Wilson Center Theater Ensemble presently because I'm an actress. I am inspired by people who are doing things with passion. Like that really matters to me. People who are doing things with a drive, who feel like they, um, you know, who, who have the energy and vision, you know, doing their own thing. It could be their own weird. And I don't care. I want to hear about it if you're excited about it. A lot of the figures that I create and the way that I write, I'm just doing what feels right for myself. I'm just, you know, when I stack wood, building a piece, when I stack objects together, I'm trying to find, I'm trying to create something that is the feeling that is the most right. When I feel afraid, I'm no longer afraid to stop and say that I'm afraid. So sometimes I get scared, I just have to admit it because I've spent too much time in my life before trying to act like I wasn't right where I was. That gives me confidence just to know that I have exactly what I need, you know? Like my fingers work the way my fingers work because they're supposed to do this this way. And so when I just say, when I own up to what I am and who I am and kind of how my mind thinks, um, then that gives me a place of peace where I'll be able to move forward um, and not be afraid. The first thing that I performed, it made me feel like my hands were light. Like I would look at my hands and just see light. And, and I had the sense enough to not need to explain it all to myself. But I was thinking about telling that story. I was thinking about getting that feeling out of my body and I could get it out of my body in the sound of those words. And that's what I wanted to do. This is the substance of my life. You know, this is art and creativity is the lens with which I experience everything. I'm one of the human beings who's actually lucky enough to just be doing what I love to do. 
and doing what I am equipped to do. Something's happening in Homewood. That's really interesting people and stories and um, that's why I'm here.